integration by parts. One of the most complex things about it is to judge whether to apply integration by parts to a question or to use something like a trigonometric identity or a substitution. Now the answer to this biggest problem lies in a very simple fact. Suppose you are integrating two different kind of functions, something like x times e to the power x. Here x is an algebraic function and e to the power x is an exponential function or e to the power x times sin x. Here it's an exponential function and it's a trigonometric function or x times ln x where one is an algebraic function and the other is a logarithmic function. In all these cases, when you're integrating to different kind of functions, you should use integration by part. Whereas, if you are integrating to similar kind of functions, something like x and square root of 1 minus x square, here x and square root of 1 minus x square are both algebraic functions, or sine x times cos x, here both are trigonometric functions. In all these questions, you should avoid using integration by parts and try to use substitution or a trigonometric identity.